just a super quick video. Uh, it says use any operating system only ADB. All right, so I'm gonna go in my root HTC One folder, and I'm going to hold uh, Shift, open command window here, and I go to my clipboard, and then paste that. Press Enter. It it sent it to my phone. I am S on at the moment, and it says open an ADB shell and. So I'll paste that. Hmm. Now we're never gonna see it. Wait. Maybe I need to add the little dot to it. Nope. My job. ADB shell. Huh. ADB shell. Yes, you. I just want this dude to walk down the street with his butt held high. <laughs> Root Android. Bring out the butt. <laughs> okay. Um, on here, real quick, I'm gonna go to developer options. No, it's not in there. Sorry. Sorry. Alright, so that's in there. Uh, did I paste the with the No, okay. So I'm gonna try CH mod. Hey, stop it! Paste that. So that's done. If your device is unlocked and ready to play switch to SU. Where the heck is the copy command? Alright, control C, I guess. Rev 1 successful. Please reboot to continue. If I have one re success, reboot the device and proceed to step 5. Now that Rev1 has successfully prepared your device or S off, please open another ADB shell and change the... ADB shell device not found, so it's got to reboot. Again, we are S on and we are on the 651.7. So the older base, it may work on the newer base, I don't know. I don't tend to up, update my bootloader because I've, you know, seen the HTC Evo 4G, the Evo Shift, the Evo 4G LTE, the Evo 3, all of them just get freaking, huh. Uh, SOP, please open it and change the data. Oh, I probably gotta do CD and then paste that. Oh, I'm in there now. Sweet. Okay. Instruct revenue grant S off by doing this. Copy over here and then paste. Rev one successful. It hasn't done anything yet. Other optional commands are unlock the device, lock the device. As if it was never unlocked. So, unlock device, lock the device, relock the device. Presuming success, this time we're rebooting the bootloader. So, we're gonna copy this right here, and hopefully, if 
I paste it. It, I accidentally bumped a button. Oh wait, I gotta exit. Put all that racing nonsense behind you and start living your life. I have a life. And then paste that again. There we go. I was S on. Oh, look at that. S off. S freaking off, man. Sweet. So to get rid of this tampered thing, I'm going to copy rerun rev1 to remove tampered from your boot screen. So I don't know if I'll need to do all that all over again, like the open ADB shell. And then paste this. Not found. Okay. All right, so we'll try this. Paste. All right, we're in there. Ch mod. All of these people, they believe in me. Paste that. All right, we're in there. So now we should be able to copy this. This is my first time doing this, so that's why this is. Ah, successful. So I'll type exit, and then. Uh, I use Ditto Clipboard Manager. I'll copy that. Alright, so now my tampered message should be gone. Aha! Ah, ha. That's awesome. That is freaking awesome. Alright, so other things you could do is like this. Unlock the device, lock the device as if it was never locked. Uh, so, oh, we have a little bit of time left. This can only be 10 minutes long. So I'll do, I'll reboot it real quick. And we'll change it to, to lock as if it was, well, I don't know if I want to do that. Reset the devices. Okay, I won't do all that. But yeah, so this video shows you Roughly how to get S off from S on. I swear to you I was S on before this and I had a brick device But Viper boy helped me bring it back If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. This is Josh is nice and I'm out Or maybe I'll put this on what Josh do. I don't know